specific game i think it's going to be a safe answer pero para mas magandang uh, kufra or grok and then the leo mort for yago okay or a lunox even feeling mm -hmm. better yeah but especially after yago's performance on the leo mort themselves Ready sports guide pa natalo yung kanilang Harith. It's not much about the Harith pick that we should be concerned about. And it's actually neither of the Your two. It's Minotaur as well as the Leomord. Now Bren Esports, they have access to the Grok. They have also access to the Kufra. But now they'll make the Grok and Grok. the Claude. Claude na target dito. Oh, I can, can I remember when Signal Ultra picked up picking. yung Kufra at Grok, Minotaur agad yung sagot ng Brent. So I think this is much better as compared to game number one. What did you say? Kufra. Well, well sa talaga. Uh, your uh, team uh, is banned. Sige, well, tingin ko sa, kasi maganda rin kasi yung, ano, yung Claude pang kite. Eh. Well, yeah. medyo may hirap nga naman siyang huliin kung pag nag-spam siya ng BMI. But you need to think about the art of delivery. The amount of slow that you can provide to the That's rest true. of the team. So, napakalaking bagay. And also, the mobility that it will, that it will provide to you. So, easier skite. Siyempre, meron din mga pang counters. But let's see, it's all about the execution din naman. It's all about the execution. Skufra is a natural answer to the Harith that's a bouncing ball na pumipigil sa Chrono Dash. For Brandy Sports, is this gonna be an Alice ban ulit? It has to be. It has you to want be. to give this Anya his Alice again? Comfort. Deny signals that comfort that they always stand for. Oh, Your team of is course, Gary. Nina din pwede tanggalin yung fact na pwede siyang pang kontra sa isang Grok. And of course, Claude. Wala siyang katapat sa late game na Marksman. Picking. So, mas comfortable siya dito. Heading to the latter stages of the game. And for Signal Ultra, kind of makes you think gusto pa nilang agahan dito. Alice is the answer of Signal Ultra picking. para sa hari. Time and time again, ito yung way nila kasi na-time na yung hari kasi meron siyang stun, meron siyang AOE control. It also has the burst against this hari. Now for Brandy Sports, what do you think guys? Ano yung kanila closing picks dito? Gusto ko makakita ng Kagura sa Bren. Kasi Ooh. again, it's, it's a problem with, uh, with, with the Alice. Eh. Well, the best thing to do against an Alice is kung kung saan nag-SS siya, aalis ka, which is the mobility of Kagura is also there and the burst potential with the Union niyang overturn. But let's see, tingin ko, isa rin sa mga pwede nilang pandagdag sa mid if they went for a double ditch competition. But they do have, they do have a choice for the Tapos and mukhang dalita ang kanilang Enjoying a hover dito. The Mart as well. I don't Tams. know. Thumbs. Oh, and Lolita. Lolita. So it seems. Okay. Medyo ninakaw nila out of Signal Ultra. Spay playbook, I mean. Although it's not, it's not, it's not gonna be Signal Ultra picking up another tank. So isang last na core na lang dito para sa Signal Ultra. Is this gonna be a Hellcurt once again? Kasi parang yun yung pinipair up nila. Or... Any other fighter? I don't know. Now I feel na yung Hellcurt pick might work for Signal Ultra. Kasi, isipin mo, magbim no one fury si Tets. Papas kasi sa inyo magbablood out siya. Magkablood out niya si Yako. Magsuswing, uh, ikot ikot na lang yan. Mapabawas niya HP ng dead mantao. Kung makakatulong Guinevere. siya sa pagbawas, hmm? pwede yun. Pero, Guinevere. Of course. Guinevere. Medyo nakalimutan niya natin. Few has been brilliant with this specific hero. Has great synergy with the Minotaur as well. That's a mga knock up and has got a lot of fast-paced tempo in her. So, Signal Ultra, they want to play this fast. Brandy Sports want to take it slow. Ano ang mas papaburan natin para sa game number three? Let's start with Swarly. What do you think? Game, kala niyo yung salbabida na to. Pinipilit ko nandito to. Hindi ko lang talaga matanggal. Ayaw, ayaw na matanggal, pero bago mo problemahin yan, problemahin muna natin dito yung laro natin dahil last game na to para sa ating semifinals. At ito na nga, di ba? The show must go on, the show must go on, Bren Esports. They are actually gonna go in with the power of nature, pero magnatakbuhan yung signal order dito. Pero I think pwede natin, habang wala pa masyadong action na nangyayari, i Gawa mo na tayo ng rundown para sa ating mga players dito. So yan, para sa side ng Bren Esports, we have here Haze. Para sa Grok, we have Rebo para sa Sams. Si Payne gamit-gamit ang Lolita. At si Yuji naman para sa Harry Coco with that Claude. Ah, for, ayun. For the side of Signal Ultra, it's going to be Tets on the Kofra. Yaku on the Leo. Ay, teka lang. Bakbakan, nangyayari dito. Nako, sino makakasecure ng buff? First blood is gonna go on to the side of Bren Esports. Si Haze ang nakakasecure.
makakakuha. Figure out na lang muna dito. Pero ito, hindi ata papaawat si Chu natin. Kita try target din itong si Yuji. Pero nako, si Pei na punish. Tamang protect lang. Pero ayaw tumigil ni Pew. Habol kong habol si Rivo. Tamang backup din. Si nako, additional damage protection para sa side ng Tindal Ultra dito. Nako, di mamamatay sa kamay. Pero palitan din naman. Dahil nandito na si Yuji at si Hei. Grabe, 3-3 agad tayo para sa 1 minute and 30 second game time. Probably one of the longest skirmishes na nakita natin dito sa MPL playoff season 3. And Coco, just farming up top. Hindi siya tumulong. Yako, tumulong doon. Uy, uy, grabe mga, ano yan ha, mag-clear ng wave, tsaka mag-pressure sa bandang taas ng mapa natin. Nagamit-gamit ulit ni Coco. Yung ginamit niya doon sa game 1 natin, na isang load. I wonder kung makakakita ulit tayo ng isang savage pa dito. No? Pero yung nang-available na, ang unang pagong ng laro, so far, I think ito na yung magiging next contestant point. Sure. But for the meantime, grabe, napakainit ang laban na to. Still, Actually, usually ma-expect mo pag nag 1, -1. By game 3, tatry nila na maging ano, less aggressive. Pero ito, pareho silang ayaw magpaawat. They're just securing their jungles. Same kasi yung, ano eh, yun yung idea ng bawat teams. Secure the other jungles, but go for the invade. And Brenny Sports has that idea just because they have the Grok. And Grok, as we all know, siya yung sa mga pinaka-best invaders sa ating game. Oo oh, naman. Usually, eh, binaban nga yan, di ba? So, bakit mo naman ihahayaan na nandito? Pero tingnan natin, no, dahil kasi palagpalag yung parehong team sa ngayon. Pero ito, nako, tamang objective muna si Yuji. Hindi yata bababa yung tore dito. Pero tatlo naman, ang asasay ng Signal Ultra. Nako, na-knock up. At ayun, nawala sa mapa. Ito, nakatapat. Nako, si Oh, oh nakap mga kaibigan. Pain dito. Hindi natutoy. You kaya yung nominan blast. But still, that will be the end of the engagement. Doon sa may middle lane, nagkakaroon ng onting push. But still, Rebo and the others trying to run away. Pero natulog siya pabalik. Opening his ultimate. But still, it won't be, they won't be able to kill Rebo kasi masyado ding makuna. Masyadong makunachi. At ito na nga, tamang ano lang, objective. Kung mapapansin mo dito, yes, both of the teams are trying to engage onto a team fight. Pero I think mas focus sa objective ang Bren Esports sa ngayon. Kasi talagang... Kung nandun sila malapit sa Tore at meron silang sapat na minion wave, talagang i-hit nila yung Tore. Kaya kita mo dito, bawas-bawas yung buhay ng mga Tore natin on to the top lane as well as in the bottom lane. Pati na rin yung mid. So I think magandang um, focus to or prioritization para sa side ng Freddy. Mm. So I drop it! Kita mo yung very aggressive crack natin dyan. Ito yung sinasabi yun. natin. All of the players here wants to win. So all the stops na pwede nila i-pull, kukunin nila yon. Nako, ito, makikita natin dito. Zaman Force has been pumped. Mukhang pepeng tayo nila. Minuman Fury, tuman yun ha. Pero teka lang, Bren Esports focus lang sa Tore. Hindi ko naman namin sasaktan dyan, Minotaur. Pero ito, sa batataan ng mapa natin, 3v2 situation na ba ito, Kuya Butters? Hindi, tamang back away muna dito ang red team natin. Jump out, slide away. Haze dito with the intercept. Puan Church again. Disanya trying to go for the ultimate. Trying to go and get the kill kay Haze. But Kufra will be the next casualty. Be here, just trying to help his teammate, pero hindi na talaga kakayanin. Grabe, hindi nila pinauwi yung signal ultra doon sa bandang taas ng mapa. Ang bilis nila mag-respond. Isang tore na lang dito, I mean, isang tore pa lang kinakukuha ng signal ultra dito sa taas ng mapa natin, ha. And I think ito yung, um, uh, yung ginagawa ng Bren Esports na talagang sinusulit nila kung ano yung lamang na meron sila sa ngayon. And uh, yun na, Signal Ultra just trying to get their jungle. Ayaw nila ibigay sa Bren Esports to. Because they know Bren, talagang yun yung pinakapunto nila dito. Just get the jungles, wala tayong pakialam. While Coco is just farming, yun na talaga yung expect mo sa kanya dito eh. Basta as long as makuha niya yung items niya, hindi nila naiisipin yung late game. Gigil kong gigil yan ng pakiramdam yata ng Bren Esports ngayon. Gigil sila na bumalik sa bandang, I mean sa upper bracket natin. Kaya naman lahat pinapwersa nila. Alam nila may kalamangan, kalamangan sila dito. Pero I think hindi pwedeng ganun lang ng ganun lagi. Kasi nakikita mo sa mga number of kills pa lang natin, alam mo na palag, palag, palag din yung signal ultra eh. Di, mas patan siya dito. He does have enough Wait. charges. For a Minowan Fury, he can go in. Does he have the flash? Hindi yata. Wala yata. Ano, nako, teka lang, ayun. Mukhang babak, makikipagbakbakan na naman ng Bren Esports dito. Tatlo ang sinusubukan nila na hulihin. Pero nakapagmamba out pa ang Signal Ultra natin. 
few just charged up dito. Kaya niya kunin Yaku. Tinamaan ng Blazing Duet. Although they're not gonna, he's not gonna get that kill. Pero nagkakaroon ng engagement dito. Numen and Blast! Sabat! And this might be the clash na hinahanap ng Brenny Sports! Uy! Grabe! Naman! Hindi pinatawa dito si Pew na huli na face check sa brush! Susunod ka na! Di kahit nagbinuwan Fury ka pa, huhulihin ka namin, Balbon! And that is a triple kill for Yelly Hayes while Coco steadily farming. Ito yung pinaka-problema nila. Coco right now is at 0-0-0. 100% uptime sa kanyang farm dito. Paano mo bipigilan ito mamaya? Alam mo, ito kasi naman eh. Usually, kapag sa lineup mo, wag wala kang marksman, gusto mo ikaw na yung makapag-lead, umpisa pa lang ng laban. Pero Bren Esports, pina-online agad nila. Itong si Coco na gamit-gamit ang ating glod. Mukhang non-stop na to para sa Bren Esports. Hindi na nila hayaan pa ang Signal Ultra. Pero knowing Signal Ultra, being as the comeback queens, mukhang may pag-asa pa. Pero tingnan natin sa taas. Let's we'll try to back away. Ay, nakakuha na naman ang kill si Coco doon. And Hayes playing the crock of his life. This is the Grok game of his life. Nakikita niya yung mga wild charge niya. He's getting a lot of kills. Coco getting caught out in the middle. BMI, this is gonna go down! Ayun lang, for the first time, nakikita kong uh, hindi nakatakas doon ng ating Coco na gamit ang Claude. Pero naka-objective naman sila doon sa bottom lane part natin kung saan nakuha nila yung tier 1 na Tore. And uh, Signal Ultra, they're not happy with that. Kasi sa bawat kill na nakukuha nila, yes, they killed Coco. Oh. But the problem was, yung lane sa baba is getting pushed. Oo, oh, yung map control. Nawawalan pa rin sila ng space dito kung saan sila makakaikot. And yung farm nila, di ba? Paano sila babawi dito? Kaya pa ba? Kaya naman, di ba? Feeling ko there's this thing about Signal Ultra na may knock sila for those kinds of comebacks. And here comes the Minoan no Fury. Nahuli si Harris dito sa may gitna. The pushback is there. Dash out si Yuji. Naman ang blast. Makakahuli ba? And Pain just going in. And now, it's Signal Ultra dito mga kaibigan. Nagtatakbuhan na. G, the last man standing. Hinakabon siya ni Hayes dito. And Hayes mga kaibigan, just not letting him go back to base. Hayes, will he be able to get the kill? Dalawang Bruce ko, nagtatakbuhan. D, mga kaibigan, tumatakbo. Papagalan yung laban dito. But Red Esports, they want to take the game. They want to take the win. They want to go to the Grand Finals. Red Esports, will they be able to do it? Signal Ultra dito, buhay na. Uy, nakuha pa. Pero ito, buhay na ulit ang Signal Ultra. Nako, nag-overstay ba sila? Nag-overcommit double kill. We'll go to hell. Si Tess, buhang ba? Magsakta. Coco going in! And this is it! Wala, wala, hindi pa pala. Sorry, excited. Meron pa palang minion wave na inaantay. Kisanya, Yaku, that defense of the last samurai, pero hindi na nila kaya. Spread, Esports is going to the Grand Finals! Grabe! Papalik sa aming upper bracket. Unfortunately, for Signal Ultra. Tell me pretty lies. Look me in the face. Tell me that you...